Hi there and welcome. Today I have here the Caseology Parallax case that I found on Amazon for $16. I have now had this case on my Galaxy Note 20 Ultra for a week now, and I would like to share my initial impressions of the case thus far, and maybe help you decide if you should purchase one too. Starting off with the design, this case weighs in at 1.48 ounces and measures in at 8 millimeters thick. While not the bulkiest or heaviest case, it is also not the slimmest or lightest case out there, so just keep that in mind if you decide to purchase. The phone goes into the case with no issues and is a snug fit. While the case is a two-piece design, you can just put it on your phone as one piece. The first layer is made of the soft silicone. You know that silicone you can't help but keep touching? The soft silicone has a neat 3D hexagonal design that the company claims is supposed to help with grip. I have to say compared to the other cases like the OtterBox Defender and Samsung leather case, the phone does tend to slide more in my hand with this case on. There are mixed reviews on this topic on Amazon so your mileage may vary on this one. The second layer of the case is made of polycarbonate and goes over the silicone layer. I must caution you to be incredibly careful with this piece as it is quite thin and could easily be broken. There are a couple of Amazon reviews where this has happened. Here at the bottom of the case, of course, you have a hole for the charge port and the S Pen. There's no issue getting access to the S Pen. The power and volume buttons have a less tactile feel than the Note's own buttons or even the Samsung Galaxy Leather case buttons. Looking at the camera bump and screen protection, it has a raised edge of approximately 3.5 millimeters around the edge of the camera and a raised edge of approximately 1.2 millimeters around the edge of the screen. I am a little concerned with the protection around the screen as some of the screen does protrude slightly above the case. To wrap it up, this case looks great. It has okay drop protection based on the other customer experiences and comes in an affordable price. While these are all good things, I'm unfortunately returning this case due to one issue that I have with it. When I hold it, the bottom of the case feels rough on my pinky finger and is extremely uncomfortable for me to hold. It is such a shame too as I love the color and styling, so should you buy one? At this price point and with a rating of 4.6 out of 5 stars, I would say go ahead and definitely buy. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and if you wish to see more reviews like this, please hit the subscribe button. Thanks for watching and take care.